this video is about how you can create your own chat bot just like ChatGPT using OpenAI API. First, I will open my Visual Studio. And click on create a new project. After that, I'll select console app and click on next. I'll call the project name as chatbot. Then for framework, you can use any framework. Um, I'm using .NET 8, but it will also work for .NET 9 as well. So you can choose either .NET 8 or .NET 9. Um, also, I have kept this checkbox checked. Do not use top level statements and then I'll create my console application. Once the project is created, I need to first install the NuGet package for OpenAI. So I'll go to tools, click on NuGet package manager, and click on NuGet Manage NuGet Packages for Solution. After that, I'll go to Browse, Browse tab, and search for Open AI. Click on the official .NET library for opening a service API, and select the project, and install the latest version. I'll install this version. Click on apply. I accept. Okay. So the OpenAI API is installed. If I double click on my project file, you can see the package has been included. I'll go back to my program.cs and from here I'll write my code to integrate OpenAI API. So the first I'll do is welcome to C sharp chatbot and uh, then I'll create a chat client. So once I have written that automatically it used that namespace open dot chat and now I'll create instance. So client equals to new model so here you can provide your uh, model which you will be using there are many models uh, gpt 4 or gpt 4 mini gpt 3.5 turbo there are many so you can use any model and uh, i'll go with gpt 4 o and uh, then i need to provide my api key api key an API key I'll be creating from the OpenAI website. So I'll go to Chrome and search for OpenAI API. So you can go here, the first link, platform.openai.com. And from here, click on the gear icon on top right. In the left panel, you will see API keys. Click on that and create a new secret key. I'll call the secret key as C sharp chatbot. And select that project and create the new secret key. Once the secret key is created, I'll copy that secret key and paste it here. So I have pasted my API key, I'll put a semicolon and my client has been created. The next thing I will do is to create a while loop. So I can interact just like a chatbot. And um, right here, console dot write. You a space and a colon. 
and string input equals to console dot read line. So I am be taking input from the user. After that, I'll create a chat completion to get the response. So chat completion completion equals to client dot complete chat input and I'll just print the response using console dot right line. Assistant. And. Uh, completion. Dot content. Posting and then. The text. And. Uh, close it with a bracket and a semicolon. And there you go. This is all you require to make a chatbot. Only six, seven lines of code. I'll run this code. So it says, Welcome to C Sharp Chatbot. I'll ask, What is the capital of France? It will take some time and say the capital of France is Paris. You can try any other input as well. Uh, tallest building in the world. And it gives the output as tallest building in the world is Burj Khalifa. So this is how you can integrate OpenAI API with C Sharp to make your own chatbot. If you have any questions, any doubts, please write down in the comments and please do like, share and subscribe.